Okay, let me have your attention for a second. Uh, John, did you tell about the mirror sizes? You did not? I did not, no. Okay, on uh, that side of the room, your mirror sizes are going to be like that. All right? That's exactly what happened. Uh, Scott uh, and the cutter had some problems. So he cut, so instead of an equilateral triangle, you get more of an isosceles, or a, yeah, an isosceles triangle, okay? That's on that side of the room. And then on this side of the room, it's equilateral. And, and it doesn't make any difference. Uh, you're, gonna get, you're gonna get a good deal. Now, uh, here's what we did wrong when we made ours. We put the base of our triangle on top, so then you can see it's, it's falling down. It's, so put your, uh, we're gonna dismantle this today, and rotate it 180 degrees. And then, uh, uh, when we went to, we made this U-shaped base, and then when we went to put this in, the space was too big. So we put a bunch of spacers in here. What I suggest you do is cut this bottom piece after you've assembled the kaleidoscope, because you'll know exactly how long you want it to be, okay? And then uh, there are three screws in here, okay? Three screws over here. Now these, uh, there are little wooden blocks right here, which you can uh, glue to this piece. And then we have some little nails up here, just from the inside, put a couple nail, little nails through it, and we'll just hold them in place, and they will set, and, and they'll be good. And then uh, you, you literally have to, and some of you guys may wonder if you can or not, but that's what helpers are for. You literally have to get a wrench down here and a wrench out here, okay? And we have a couple of socket sets to, to make that easier. Um, let's see, uh, you're gonna start by taking your mirrors, you need help for this, and making your triangle and taping. So you have three four foot long strips of tape, okay? And then you got your triangle, then you're gonna take your tube and bring your tube and lower it down over the triangle, okay? And if it goes down snugly at all three points, it's your day to buy a lottery ticket. Here's what's interesting. These are all 12 inch tubes, and if you go shopping for them, believe it or not, you, they are packaged so that you can put one inside of another and another one inside of that one. It, it's, I think it's probably for space saving, for transportation and everything. So the quality control isn't great. Now, <laughs> you, you're also going to take these guys. Okay, and John came up with a good idea. Take your circle, which is a little different from somebody else's probably, and, and cut out a, a, you know, a foot square and put, it, put your circle on there and trace it out. Okay, and, and then make a circle. And then you can cut, I'll call these little curved sections, then you can cut them by holding your circle up here. You want it nice and snug. And you want uh, one here, one in the middle, and one down at this end, okay? And then you'll have left a triangle, and I thought, well, maybe that triangle would fit in here real snugly, because uh, we had those cheapy shower caps that, from a hotel, that, because, you, because it gets really dusty. So, so if you put the little triangular section there, that might be perfect. Then you need a little handle on it, obviously, to get it out of there. Can you think of something that I didn't tell you that you're confused about? Well, first do the mirrors. First do the mirrors, yeah. We have good pieces to make them. Stay. Yes, we have all the wood here. Everything's here. I'll start getting stuff uh, in here. Um, you're going to cut your tube down a little bit. Okay, right? <coughs>